Hey you, welcome. <laughs> Hi guys. Today I have something really special for you guys, and it's a reaction video. Today I have decided that I'm gonna embarrass myself a little. I'm gonna um, show. I have my phone right here, and I'm going to show things that, to be honest, I'd rather have hidden. I was like, okay, you know what? Let me just come on here and do a little reaction of the things I used to post on Facebook when I was still a child. You know, since I was born, and now I get it. Eh? I have never seen. All right, all right, okay. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. So, yeah, let me just open the app and go to ooh, this one. Okay, so this one is a picture of me and two of my friends. I'm still very close to one of them today. We are living in the same unit, but we are. We used to be in a music group where we used to go every. There was a rehearsal day that I can't actually remember the time now, but we used to go to rehearse on these days. And yeah, it's not such a bad picture. Maybe my own friends, eh? but it's not such a bad picture. Maybe I wouldn't draw my brows like this anymore. And of course, I wouldn't use this foundation then. What did I know? I was a makeup enthusiast, but now I'm a pro, okay? All right, so on to the next. Okay, so this particular picture is of me and my brother. Trust me, he's a lot fresher now. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know who this human being is. And, oh, it's so hot in here. I don't know who this human being is. But that's not the brother I know, okay? And definitely, again with the brows, ignore. I, I did not know what I was doing. <laughs> I feel like my brother looks worse in this video as as compared to me because this this particular picture I still remember it that it was from um, um, one convention I think is it EGFM can't really remember what it is but this convention was me finding my way you know, into Christ and I was like okay you know what I'm gonna go for this convention I asked my dad for permission at the time I said to take my brother along he even gave us money something my dad never do on a normal day but yeah this is you know this is us like I don't even think I drew my brows yet what is this thing on here Jesu! I, I don't even know what this is then you leave out your hair you know what moving on Oh, my brother really looks worse. I mean, he's fresher now. I'm gonna insert the picture of him right now, but... Ish. Okay, so this one now is another one of me and my sibling. And it's pretty interesting because then I just discovered this new editing app. Or was it the Blackberry editing software? I don't know. Sha! One of them. And what I used to do was I used to make my eyes like bigger. Because I felt like it looked cute. I look like all those cute babies. But it not look cute. <laughs> this is not cute. <laughs> there is nothing cute about it. So yeah, moving on to the next. Oh, this one. Oh God. Okay, so at this point in time, I was already exploring um, my creative makeup side. I was beginning to see that I loved special effects. I loved graphics, you know. And so I saw this created on somewhere on Instagram at the time and I was like you know what I'm going to recreate this and so I recreated it and I forwarded it to my choir group chat Sha nobody responded to me because I forwarded it and I was like Merry Christmas guys nobody responded so yeah well I mean the makeup itself isn't so bad I love glitter at the time so I did this glitter eye and then with the underlining, green eyeliner, everything was really, really, but maybe I can recreate this look one time. Let me know if you guys want to see that. All right. So the, okay. Okay. So this one, the same thing, the same situation, the same scenario. I have 
this blackberry i'll smoothing my face out this picture was taken in a downfall to show you how desperate i was i felt like i was looking super cute that day and i even think i chopped embarrassment where i was going to this particular day but um, i was like okay this picture looks cute i was all about the matte lip at the time my foundation was better and of course i was gonna make my eyes a lot bigger i'm not proud of it please don't crucify me thank you oh this picture was my dp for the longest time i still remember using this picture and then my friend asked, asked me and she was like why is your eyes so big the picture is shark cute that's what i thought about it at the time i rolled my hair everything the picture of shark cute to me and so that's it took this picture of my infinix hot tube that year bought it with my it money very proud of it for that time i mean you guys would admit that this picture is a super cute picture let me know what your thoughts are i think it's cute but let's pass this picture because i have no explanation i think i've been begging you people since oh my god okay so this one was in my year one and then there was this wevon they were selling that time those sewing weaves they were selling that time and on the pack had tonto with this tonto dk with this really short hair that she did and everything and i was like hmm let me go and do this and i buy the hair and i take it to somewhere in songo i went there to go and get the hair done and everything and then this woman did the hair and i was like no i'm not satisfied with the hair I don't like it, that kind of thing. And then she goes and adjusts, cuts, cuts, cuts. But I was, I still wasn't really, really feeling the hair. Maybe she just wasn't a good cutter. I wasn't feeling the hair like that. Sha, this was the only picture I took of the hair before I removed it because I was just like, you know what? Let me just take one picture of this hair. I still go home and cut, cut it myself, but I wasn't satisfied. And so I removed the hair completely because I was like, there's no point having something that I wasn't proud of. I mean. There was this particular lipstick that a friend of mine at the time gave me, I think from school. So that was what I was using. Yeah. And the key holder chain. You are the key to my heart. You are the key to my heart. When sickness and trouble seem to take my soul away. You hold the key to my heart. I mean, that's the vibe I get from this uh, necklace. I mean, and it doesn't even match the earrings. The earrings are more like Owambe party vibe. And then this necklace is looking like key to heaven. Moving on. What is up with me and taking pictures in buses? This is another daffo. And so at the time, I was really, really playing around with cutting my hair and all of that. And so this particular um, picture, I took it in a daffo and it looked like I cut my hair, but my hair was actually really packed. And that time I was feeling, I loved all these bogus, bogus earrings. For someone who had not, who had not been allowed to wear earrings or necklaces or do makeup or any other thing, I finally felt like I got my freedom in school. Do you get what I mean? So getting that freedom now, all that was running through my mind was get the biggest, boldest, anything and wear because it was almost like I was just tasting ice cream for the first time. I wanted it everything. The only bad twisting me again. Anyway, that's this one. The same lipstick in the other picture. Same here. Now, one thing I've come to discover with all these pictures that I've been taking is that I actually don't mind how I looked back in the day. I was like, I was super, super fashionable. Like I wasn't one of those raz like i was super fashionable even with all the withdrawal like see i was when i'm giving you advice take it with your chest okay so this particular one i woke up one morning and i was really really feeling the urge to have a picture because our life was boring there was nowhere that we were going so i was like okay i took this picture and then i posted it on facebook after posting it to facebook was when i realized that the picture was not cute and I was so embarrassed. And then in the cop in the caption, I edited the I edited the caption and I was like, sorry, I'm not feeling fine today. It was a lie. I was not, I was okay, I wasn't sick. I just wanted to explain why I looked like Pepe Sella. So for those of you that are following me at that time, sorry. I'm not typically a liar like this. I feel like my younger self was such a babe like such a babe look at the hair 
you know the face, I knew my angles. People had a lot to learn from me. Okay, even me, I don't understand this concept with the scarf around my neck. I was trying to form Londona, but it just wasn't working out. And then the top. Okay, that time I had very limited clothes. I was not like I had everything that I thought I liked. Or so I made the best out of what I had at the time. So let's not talk about this too much. Let's move on. Oh, okay. This is my first, very, very first picture on on Facebook. This picture, I still remember I had this big heart on the wall that says big girl in the middle and then I put plenty plenty designs like I was always the creative like I was always a creative I wanted to touch up things I wanted to make them better but at the bar now I know guess the resources I don't have so I made do with what I had so in this picture I wanted my wristwatch to feature because I just I think that my dad that got me this wristwatch it was cute at the time I wanted to, to to make the wristwatch pop and then I wanted the wall art the graffiti to show as well and so I did that and this was the first picture I uploaded to Facebook I mean it's not so bad it's not so bad like it all oh, one thing that you guys can say with your full chest in all is that I am a cutie okay so yeah we have come to the end of this reaction video i hope you guys enjoyed it because i did i mean looking through some of these pictures and just giving my opinions on them and comparing to, comparing them with the things i have now the pictures i have of myself on my phone and i'm just like one thing that is permanent in life is growth and change but i hope everybody will choose growth and um i'll see you guys in my next video thank you for stopping by please like subscribe and yeah leave me a comment let me know what you like to see i don't think i should be begging people you people like me already so if you want to see something just say hey girl make this and you know i'll come through so yeah take care bye see you in my next one just mommy you just interrupted my video Sorry. so So this one, lady just brought it.